Dear students, question number fourth we have. The sums of first n terms of three arithmetic progressions are s1, s2 and s3 respectively. The first term of each AP is 1 and their common differences are 1, 2 and 3 respectively. Prove that s1 plus s3 is equal to twice of s2. So, in this question, we have three arithmetic progressions given that are s1, s2 and s3. The first term is given like s1, s2 and s3 arithmetic progressions are AP, SM given and terms. The first term is that is A. वो सब की सेम है दैट दैट इज 1 एंड जो उनका कॉमन डिफरेंस है इसको हम डी से रिप्रेजेंट करते हैं दैट आर 1 2 एंड 3 हमें प्रूव करना है कि s1 plus s3 इज इक्वल्स टू ट्वाइस ऑफ सम ऑफ टू टर्म्स फर्स्ट टर्म ऑफ ईच एपी is represented with A that is 1 the common differences and the common difference are 1, 2 and 3 we know the formula of sum of n terms so here we will write S1 is equal to n upon 2, 2a plus n minus 1 into d. In place of a, we will put its value that is 2 into 1 plus n minus 1 into d. In place of d, we put 1. So here, n upon 2, 2 plus n minus 1 therefore s1 is equal to n upon 2 2 uh, 2 minus 1 that is 1 so here comes 1 plus n which is equal to and we open the bracket here comes n upon 2 into 1 here comes n upon 2 plus n square upon 2 so this is our uh, so this is the value of S1, sum of first term. Next, we have to find S2. S2 is equals to n upon 2, 2a two plus n minus 1 into d, which is n upon 2. A remains same for every term, so here comes 1 plus in place of d. We put its value that is 2. Here comes n upon 2. 2 plus 2 into n to n minus 2. After that n upon 2. Here both to cancelize. Both the signs are opposite. So here comes 2n. And we open the bracket n upon 2 into 2n. This 2 cancelizes with this one. So we get the value of S2 which is n square. Next we will find the value of S3 which is n upon 2, 2a two plus n minus 1 into d. Here comes n upon 2 in place of a we put its value that is 1 n minus 1 in place of d we put its value that is 3 so, n upon 2 2 plus 3 and minus 3 n upon 2 3 n minus 3 plus 2 that is minus 1 we will open the bracket 3 n square upon 2 minus n upon 2 so this is the value of s3 now we know the relation that is s1 plus s3 is equals to twice of s2 we will put the value of s1 which is n upon 2 plus n upon 2 plus n square 
upon 2. And square root 2, yeah. Upon 2. Plus, in place of S3, we will write 3 and square upon 2. 3 and square upon 2. Minus n upon 2. Which is equal to twice of S2. Which is n square. Now, here n upon 2 and minus n upon 2. Both are both have different signs, so they both are cancelized. So left over we have n square upon 2 plus 3 n square upon 2 is equals to 2 n square. We will take common n square upon 2. So in bracket here comes 1 plus 3 which is equals to 2 n square. n square upon 2, 3 plus 1 which is 4 is equals to 2 n square. So here comes 2 into 4 that is 2. So here comes 2 n square is equals to 2 n square. Therefore, left hand side is equals to RHS. Hence, proved. So this is the end of our question.